the most beautiful car in the world. Are you a fan of the aesthetics of cars rather than performance? But what if you could find both in a single car? In this video, we will discuss the most beautiful car in the world. The car was given the award for the most beautiful concept car at the Festival Automobile International. With a sleek and masterfully crafted design, this car is a work of pure art. Hello, and welcome to our channel, Supercar News Network. If you are a car enthusiast and want to know about supercars, make sure to subscribe to the channel, like the video, and press the bell icon to get notified every time we upload a new video about supercar specs, reviews, drag races, and much more. Renault is well known for producing a variety of automobiles, including compact hatchbacks like the Zoe and practical people transporters like the Kangoo ZE. It is not known for producing high-performance luxury GTs, but with the fantastic Renault Trezor concept car, it has dared to dream in this arena. The Trezor concept is a sports GT that is almost as futuristic as the company's Easy Ultimo limousine. Renault has introduced a two-seater electric concept car, the Trezor, prototype at the Paris Motor Show in 2016. This marks the next phase in the brand's revival and showcases its most recent technology, as well as the future of the car industry as Renault sees it. Trezor was created by French designers to have the characteristics of a classic coupe Gran Turismo. It also features carbon fiber bodywork, mahogany front fascia, and a racing-inspired engine. The car does not have any conventional doors. Rather, it has a light cabin that can be raised to enable access to the interior. This feature lends the vehicle a look that is similar to cars from the 60s and 70s of the previous century. A recognizable front-end branding and distinctive C-shaped front lighting are combined with futuristic exterior characteristics, such as a variable, ge such as a variable geometry forward air intake, fiber optic taillights, and hexagon-shaped body panels. A cool detail is that in place of the gas filler neck, there is an analog dial that displays the current battery level. The design includes two batteries, and each one has its own cooling system. The high-performance electric sports automobile is equipped with features of auto driving. There are multiple modes, including normal, sports, and autonomous, for the user's utmost comfort. Exterior Long hood, low roof, wide body, and wheel arches that look like they've been flexing their muscles are all design features that are characteristic of sporting GT vehicles, such as Aston Martins, Bentleys, Ferraris, and Jaguars. However, the Trezor propels them into the future with its innovative features, including as a honeycomb bonnet intake that gives the impression that the Trezor is breathing and fiber optic lights at the rear of the device. A continuous wraparound screen that is part visor, part fighter canopy, and part tinted goggles is the frosting on the cake, as is upper carbon fiber bodywork that swings outward at the front lights, like unlocking a jewelry box. The usage of a roof in the form of a clamshell, which opens up to allow passengers to access the interior of the car, is primarily responsible for the absence of any apparent lines inside the vehicle. The one-piece canopy opens by swinging on struts and hinging forward. When autonomous mode is activated, the vehicle's trademark external lights go through a transformation. In addition to carbon fiber scoops that help keep the brakes cool, the vehicle has front wheels measuring 21 inches and rear wheels measuring 22 inches. The spaces between the spokes on the wheels are shaped like the Eiffel Tower. The Renault Trezor concept is quite long, at 4,700 millimeters, yet it only weighs 1,600 kilograms because of its lightweight construction. This reasonably low weight is accomplished because of the significant usage of carbon fiber that went into developing its monoscope chassis, as well as the single-piece clamshell roof that functions as a cabin access hatch. The low-slung vehicle also has a tall hood and muscular fenders, which not only give the car an aggressive look, but also make it a lot more aerodynamic. Interior. When you raise the clamshell bodywork of the Trezor, slide over the side because it's so low, and peek inside, you will notice that the interior is actually red, and not simply because the tinted glazing makes it appear that way. Genuinely red. It even has sunset pinkish reds for the digital displays, which adds some high-tech sophistication to the old-school craftsmanship. The dashboard is made out of red ash wood, which sounds dreadful, but looks wonderful. The seats are made out of luxurious red leather, which was influenced by luxury furniture. The car also includes a carbon fiber chassis and a wood frame under the hood that functions as a baggage rack. The wooden frame was constructed in collaboration with a French bicycle maker called Keem. It needed to maintain the Desir's legacy of great elegance and efficiency, despite the fact that this meant compromising maximum speed. 
The interior of the car has an angular steering wheel, which is kept in style with Formula One. When transitioning to autonomous mode, the angular wheel splits into two halves that move apart from one another. Screens and touch panels take up the majority of the available space in the middle of the front panel. The front of the Trezor is where you'll find the luggage compartment, which is designed to hold the suitcases made specifically for the Trezor. After you've entered the vehicle, a prompt will appear on the dashboard instructing you to position your mobile device within a designated compartment located below the center armrest. After that, it will synchronize with the car in order to customize the settings and greet you. The mesmerizing interior provides enough space for two people to be seated comfortably inside thanks to the spacious 2700mm wheelbase of the car. In addition, the curved OLED display is protected by Corning Gorilla Glass from scuffs and scratches. Drivetrain Trezor has a brake-activated energy recovery system using the Rechargeable Energy Storage System technology, RESS. This indicates that it can travel further before requiring its next charge. The powertrain that's employed in Renault's Trezor concept car is developed from a Formula E car. In this configuration, it is capable of producing 348 horsepower and 380 newton meters of torque. Although the maximum range of the car has not been specified, the rear wheel achieves sufficient electric power to complete the 0 to 60 miles per hour sprint in less than 4 seconds. Engineers from Renault have equipped the vehicle with two large air-cooled batteries, one of which is located in the front of the vehicle while the other is located in the rear, in order to achieve the ideal weight distribution between the two axles. Because it possesses a drag coefficient of 0.22, this vehicle is considered to be one of the most aerodynamically efficient automobiles in the world. Driving Modes You have the option of selecting one of the following three driving styles. Neutral, for the drive you take on a daily basis. Autonomous, this car can drive itself, allowing you to relax and take in the view, watch a movie, or talk to your friend. Sport, this one is for when you're seeking a bit more excitement. These driving styles can be selected from the multi-sense system that is offered by Renault. This system not only gives you the ability to choose how you want to drive, but also how you want the lighting to be inside the cabin. Production The production was initially expected to start in 2020, but that did not happen. Recently, it's been said the car will go into production in the latter part of 2023. After the car hits the market, it will not be the exact same as the concept prototype. Rather, there will be some changes made to the initial design. Even though this car appears as though it should be in a sci-fi movie set, we have to admit that this vehicle has a special place in our hearts. It just sounds like the kind of vehicle one can spend hours in and enjoy every minute of it.